You're saying that I can't work, have a hairstyle because of your culture? Yeah. Why? Boy, ain't no way, boy. Boy, ain't no way, boy. Do you know what it was in Egyptian culture? Are you Egyptian? Nah, no, I'm not. Are you Egyptian? No, but it doesn't matter. Wait, where's Egypt? Tell me. You know what, girl? Where's Egypt? Dude, go. You have no oh, right to tell me Ooh, what I can not get. Huh? Where's Egypt? Yo, girl, stop touching me. Right? Yo, girl, stop touching me right now. Come back. Get off hey. of me. Say white girls shouldn't wear braids. I'm not saying that because I just don't want you to wear my hairstyle. Whenever I see people going off about cultural appropriation like this, I have one thing to say, and that is cultures are not owned. Cultures have always been and will continue to be shared. Which means Kim K can do this, and Hailey Bieber can line her lips for goodness sake without being called out for cultural appropriation. They're not appropriating anything. And yes, people are going to make profits off of things that have been traditionally black, just like black people profit off of things that have been traditionally white. Hola amigos, this is Will Witt with PragerU. Today we're at UCLA talking to college students and on Olvera Street talking to Hispanics in honor of Halloween and to see if my outfit is offensive. <laughs> Dang it. Would you guys like to chat with us today? No. That's what we want to talk to you about. Hola. You find my outfit offensive? Yes. Yeah. You find it offensive? <laughs> Do you find it offensive? Uh, maybe a little. Do you think my outfit is offensive? Are you Mexican? No. Yes. I think it reaffirms stereotypes that are offensive to people. You think people really think Mexican people are like this and carry around marachas? No, I don't think people actually think that. Do you find my outfit offensive? Yes. Yeah. Why? Because it's not your culture. Cultural appropriation? Why do you say that? Because you're not, like, Mexican. Do you think Mexican food is, like, cultural appropriation? No. Someone else's culture that we've kind of taken. It can't make sense. Eating and taking Mexican food, not cultural appropriation. Wearing Mexican outfits, cultural appropriation. Makes a lot of sense. Gotcha. Cultural appropriation? Oh, <laughs> I no comment. <laughs> um, you don't really understand what their culture means and what it means to wear these things, like the hats and the maracas. You know, you sort of have to understand where all of this comes from for it to not be cultural appropriation. It's not yours. <laughs> Did she just touch him when the mustache was his? But if it was the other way around, we all know it will be a different story. But, oh, it's okay to take his things without his consent. Gotcha. Can I just ask you, do you like my costume? I like your, your, your mustache. Do you? Monthly. <laughs> Does my outfit offend you? You look, no, no, no. You look nice. Thank you. Do you like my costume? No yes. Does it offend you? No. No. No, nothing. That's good. Me guapo? This is guapo. This is beautiful. Beautiful. Acaba. Are you guys insulting me? No. <laughs> insulting me in Spanish? Um, do you like Do you like my outfit? Oh yeah, it's awesome. Does my outfit offend you? No, not at all. Some people get offended by what I'm wearing. No, it's not. It's not offensive. I think it's uh, you're in the right atmosphere. Yeah. <laughs> Único dice de mar mostacho, no original. No, no, not no original. Do you know who sold me this? No idea. Mexicans. Oh, really? And so you're white and you get offended, but then Mexican people who sold me this and made me this don't get offended. That, yes. Seems kind of weird, doesn't it? I love it, actually. White liberals want to be offended at everything. And I've posted something in my community post, and I'm sure some of you have seen it, where white people feel as if they're doing good deeds for people of color, as they call them, when they say everything is racist, as if people of color, as they call them, will come to them as if they're their saviors. It's a white savior left problem. The Mexicans weren't offended but the people who weren't Mexican were offended on behalf of the Mexicans. This is what happens 
when you become woke. Think it's offensive? No, not at all. Some people get really offended by this. Why do you think that is? I don't know. It just you're not Mexican, so people think that you have to be Mexican to wear that. You're celebrating Mexico. Yeah, that's awesome. Are you Mexican? I am. See. I'm not Me wearing it. See? Well, that's okay. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe we should swap outfits. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, exactly. The most stupidest concept I've ever seen is you can't wear something if you're not from that culture. I wonder the amount of things, items, whatever it is, music, anything that these college students who said it was cultural appropriation indulge in, but they don't call it cultural appropriation. I'm sure they eat people's foods that aren't from their country but they won't call it that. All the woke liberals are, are virtue signaling, woke, everybody's a victim, woe is me, everything is racist, that's all they are. But anyway, that was another video, another reaction. As I usually say, if you guys enjoyed the video, like the video as much as possible, comment down below. I'll reply to as many comments as possible. So comment down below, subscribe to the YouTube channel, follow me on Instagram and Twitter at Yinka That Guy, and I am out.